Okay guys, so I know that I made a short earlier today that said that I wasn't going to do an edible video today because I had new flour coming in, but then I found out later that the flour wasn't going to be here till later tonight and I wouldn't be able to get a video out. So I actually am going to do a video on edible today. I'm actually going to be covering these right here. These are the Hidden Hills Rainbow Belts, which they did send my way. Uh, once again, thank you guys so much for sending this care package my way. And as you guys can already see, I have opened this. That's because I've tried this and I wanted to see how good it was beforehand. And they're absolutely fire. I'm just going to be upfront and honest with y'all. These things are amazing. So the 300 milligrams per piece, uh, they have live resin in them. They're D11, D9, THCP. It's the fire, fire, fire blend. The same blend that they had in that disposable I just reviewed. I'll pop up the uh, little thumbnail for it. The only problem I'll say with these is that they're kind of like thin and falling apart, but absolutely delicious. So cheers y'all. I will say, these do have a little bit of a weedy taste to them, so you're going to get that kind of like, you almost get that film on the back of your teeth that you can go, oh, I know there's weed in this, but it's not bad or unpleasant. There's a whole strip for y'all. This is 300 milligrams. Mm. But I got to tell you guys, these are absolutely fire. And I don't know how much milligrams I'm eating right now. I'm probably about a thousand nearly. But I'm at work. So I just ate a bunch of those. Now it's about how it affects me. So I'm going to come back to y'all in about an hour and a half, let you know how I'm feeling. Uh, by the way, I'm going to be at the shop all day, so don't worry. I'll be sober by the time I'm going home. Also, we're almost at 1,900 subscribers and almost at 2,000 subscribers, really. So uh, please make sure you go like, comment, and subscribe while I'm at it because, you know, we're growing at a rapid rate and it's crazy. I mean, I had a video hit 11,000 views the other day. Um, we're almost at 500,000 views. So you guys have really been killing it and let's keep it on. So thank you guys so much and I'll see you all in a little bit. Okay, guys, it's been about an hour and a half and I got to tell you, I'm already starting to feel some of the effects from those... Uh, rainbow belts i i'm already starting to get that relaxed calm minded like really feel comfortable in my own skin kind of feel comfortable in everything around me feeling it's like super warm relaxing uh, i feel nice and happy kind of giddy a little bit on the like more like laughy side right um i definitely feel a little bit more on that slower side too i feel like everything's kind of slowed down a bit and you can probably tell that in the way i'm talking versus how i was talking earlier um but yeah, I mean, overall, like, these Hidden Hill belts just smack. The only thing that I would say is that on the COAs, it did appear that there wasn't actually any D9, D11 in here. There was THCP, D9 THCP, and D8 THCP, but uh, there wasn't any D9 or D11 in here, but there's a lot of Delta 8. So, it's still pretty strong, I'm not going to lie. Like, it definitely is a, a pretty strong edible, and I would not recommend most people taking large quantities of this like I did because, well, it's a lot, but, um, yeah, I just hope the next, you know, couple of hours for my day go well, and I don't get, fall asleep or anything like that, I don't think anything bad will happen, obviously, I take edibles all the time, guys, so don't worry about me, I am a professional pothead, but, like, I don't know, I feel right, I feel happy, I feel amazing, this is awesome, now I'm probably gonna go outside and smoke to even add to it, I don't know, maybe, but uh, we just got fun little update on the shop, by the way. We just got a, a, we're getting our drywall done soon, hopefully this Sunday and everything. So Sunday and Monday and everything. Then we're changing out the ceiling tiles, replacing the light fixtures. So hopefully in about a week or so, we'll be able to full be remodeled and everything ready to go. And then looks like March 24th is going to be our grand opening. So stay tuned for that, guys. It's going to be super dope. I'm probably going to stream the grand opening. So yeah, stay tuned for that, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all the love and support. Uh, yeah, I don't know what else to do for the video, guys. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.